All right, and here we go with our last video. We're going to be talking about both how to factor a sum of cubes and a difference of cubes. So let's start out first looking at a sum of cubes. Kind of has a, has a special form, and that's when we see something cubed plus something cubed. We have something cubed plus something cubed. It factors into f plus l times f squared minus f l plus l squared. Then we could also factor a difference of cubes, f cubed minus l cubed, which equals f minus l times f squared plus f l plus l squared. All right, so a couple of examples here. I say Example, factor first one is if I have 8x cubed minus 27 hey notice here that we have something cubed minus something cubed now what is it that's cubed each time it's a difference of cubes so it's the second version First thing is this is 2x quantity cubed, and this one is 3 cubed. So this is like our f, and this is like our l. Alright, so in the minus version, it's right here, it starts out with f minus l, so this is equal to f minus l, that's 2x minus 3, times f squared, well that's f, which is 2x squared, plus f times l, that's 2x times 3, plus l squared, 3 squared, so this is all equal to 2x minus 3 times 4x squared plus 6x plus 9. There it is. Okay, very last example here. Let's look at a sum of Squares problem. Let's take a look at eight x to the ninth plus one hundred twenty-five. Sum of squares and or sum of cubes and what's being cubed this time? Well, this is two x to the third cubed plus 5 cubed. This is F, this is L. This is F plus L, which is 2x to the third, plus 5, times F, which is 2x to the third, squared plus minus f times l 2x to the third times 5 plus l squared so all together here we have 2x to the third plus 5 
times 4x to the 6th minus 10x to the 3rd plus 25. Final answer. Two examples. How to factor a sum of cubes and a difference of cubes. So this is a sum of cubes and difference of cubes. And this concludes our fifth and final video on factoring a sum of cubes and a difference of cubes. Thank you for your time. I hope uh, you found these beneficial. We will again be reviewing any questions you may have about this in class last uh, on when we meet for class on Tuesday. Have a good weekend. Bye.